who he is. He is a fresh 32 if you can have right. that type of mentality. The one thing I would say is, you know, Zimmer talked about it after the season with the offensive coordinator, Pat Shermer. The, the glaring issue on this offense is they can't run the football, and they have to be a run-dominant team. And whether that's offensive line-wise, whether it's Adrian Peterson, there's a lot of cash, a lot of blame to go around. But at 18 million, that's that's a big deal. If if you feel like you can't get it this year with the offensive line you have, you might say, hey, let's part ways, let him go continue his career, and we'll kind of take a year or two to find ourselves but a back. If you saw the protection of that line and Sam Bradford's limitations, yes. oh. you may say eighteen million's worth it. Now, Jerome, you mentioned for another team. Which team do you think would be a fit for AP? Though? Well, I think a great fit would be a team in his own division, the Detroit Lions. I think Ooh, that okay, would be yeah. an issue uh, for the Minnesota Vikings. <laughs> if, Detroit, if Detroit were able to get a, a player like Adrian Peterson, put him in the backfield, now they, they have something really special. They made the playoffs last year with virtually no running game. So now you put a player like Adrian Peterson on that football team, watch out. Hey, what about the Green Bay Packers? The farm switch around, <laughs> right? Like we can go the other way. You're yeah, going absolutely. to hate it and hate it. All these, I mean, just the rivalry in itself. He he could find a home there. We one. know they need a running mm -hmm. back with with the way Eddie Lacy's been, kind of his career has been going.